Where did you find it? The guy at the bar. Mm, nice. Very nice. He works for the owner, the guy next to him. Not nice. Very not nice. I met him rollerblading on the boardwalk. Mm -hmm. He gave me a pass and a pen. What? Did he want your autograph? <laughs> he wanted me to have a good time. I don't get it. Good evening, ladies. I just wanted to know which one of your lovely asses were going to meet mine on the dance floor. As much as we appreciate your ass, our asses are kind of busy. Well, you know what I think? I think it's gonna be you. I don't think so. Oh, come on, huh? What's your problem? There's no problem. I think you've had a little too much to drink. No. Let's go get some air. Why? Hey, there's no problem. Ladies. Yeah, fine. Sorry about him. No problem. He's around the house. Has a thing for pens. He sure does. What are you doing? Um... Best high in town. You're doing drugs in the middle of the club. What's the problem? Everybody is. Look, we're all here together. There's plenty of hot guys. Yeah. Isn't that enough? Do you guys lighten up? Yeah, yeah. Let's just finish our drinks and get out of here. This place is too strange. Seems stranger. You're so drunk you're seeing things, aren't you? I'm fine. I paid my money just like everybody else. in the basement. I think it still works. How many more of these do you think you're gonna need? Many more. Many more. Only this. Screen. Only this screen needs to work. Right. If you don't mind me asking, what exactly are we doing? Looking for them. Got your cell phone. You're probably gonna need it. Cell phone. Phone. You can talk to people when they're not near you. Why? So you can reach me. Or anyone. When you're far away. Except where there's no signal, which is pretty much everywhere I seem to be. Where I seem to be. Where you seem to be. Where you seem to be. Never mind. 
The bars on the left show you how strong the signal is. The ones on the right show you how much power your battery has left. Manual, charger. The number's on the back. What is this? Just a train. I've seen this. That's right, where I first dropped you off. What is a train? Form of transportation? No. Um, containers full of people hooked together that travel on long metal tracks. Tracks. They came here, same as me. Why is their speech so much more advanced than yours? My life force was whole. I made me from picture on the road. They have humans to learn from. I learn what I see and hear. A billboard. And they did the same thing. No. Why not? In prison, life force was taken, given back in small parts each day. When they came, they needed life force quickly, or they would die. You mean human bodies? Yes. So, the question is, where do they find 218 people in the middle of nowhere fast? Train. Train. Just gonna see Cole for a sec. Why? I uh, need some aspirin. We're all out. We're all out? This club I went to last night was so nah. My head is still splitting. He doesn't have any either. He told you he's out of aspirin? Yeah. The other day I had a headache and I asked him for one. What's up now? What do you mean? I mean, it's a bit odd in case you hadn't noticed. You pick him up from the highway, and he walks around here in his briefs. Not that I mind having a peek once in a while. But he is definitely... How can I put this? Off? Hauling in gear, always up there with his door closed, doesn't have a job. What's up? <sighs> He's... Undercover. 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 Undercover for who? I can't say. You don't know. Look, I had to take a leap of faith myself. <sighs> he said it was so big, he couldn't tell me. Mel. 
He's hot as hell, okay? But you've got to stop believing everything every guy tells you. And this one really is odd. <clears throat> Hello, Mel. Hi. I need to talk to you about Jess. How does it work? Oh, here. She's been asking a lot of questions. Where did you get this? A machine at train place. You took this from the ATM at the station? You can't just go breaking into cash machines. Why? Because that's where people get their money. They're very sensitive about this kind of stuff here. another camera at the station there was not look i had to make up a story about you to tell jess she looks at me like food she's hot for you she likes you you are hot for me no you like me yes but it's not the same kind of like why because there's a hundred reasons, I guess, but basically there's either a jump in the bones kind of thing happening or there's not. And there's just not. Yes, ma'am. New club on Michigan. Here is pretty happening. Uh, I can't wait. Always 805. Uh, too weird for me. It's hard to party in the same space as paper boys and grandpas. Yes. I think we know what you like about 805, Mandy. Not again. Look, do you really have to do that? Don't knock it till you've tried it, hun. They're all the same. Highly overrated. I just wanted to talk to you about... What's that? Holds life forces. Could you be a little bit more specific? This takes life forces from prisoners, then they are stored here. What are those? Each one is cell. Wait a minute. You mean that you suck the fugitives' life forces out of their human bodies and then put them in those balls? Yes. Where did this come from? Came with me. You're going to be keeping dangerous alien prisoners in those tiny silver balls? No, I will take them back to Sartop. Sartop? Yes, prison on moon in my guard system. You mean like a solar system? Yes, where I come from. Six planets. 
My home is Siran. And you were a tracker on this Sartop prison? No, I was... guard. Make sure we stayed. What's so special about Ree? He killed... my wife and daughter. You wanted to talk to me, Mel. No. No, that's okay. Good night, Mel. What you mean? One of them's in the hospital. From the truck. And she? You told me that the club was for our kind only. You said nothing about letting humans in. Well, humans will buy Feck Mom faster than we can produce it. You are jeopardizing our mission. I want them out of the club. Do you understand? Of course. I overslept. It's 10 o'clock. I know, I know. I was up half the night. Look, Jess, I know you like to party. <laughs> it wasn't that. Then what? My friend Mandy's in the hospital. What happened? She OD'd. I think she's going to be OK, but they're keeping her in the hospital just for a few more days. I tried to tell her. She's got to do everything her own way. <laughs> and you know what? Her own way resulted in her having a heart attack this time. <laughs> Stupidest thing. Some guy sold her this drug, these green drops she put in her eyes. In her eyes? Yeah. They came these pens that were like droppers. Where did she get this? down on Smithfield. I'll get my keys. What do you call the drops Jess talks of? Drugs. You have drugs here? Yeah. There was a drug on Sata, Fect mine, taken the same way. In the eyes? Yes. So you guys have eyes? All six life forms in Mygar have visual organs. Great. Eyes are great. Just said it was an old fish warehouse. This must be it. How do you know? Mostly because it says fish company, then there's the tuna on top. There's another way in. Fine. It's good Mel. You're not supposed to swallow it. There is no club here. Just said it was set up like a regular club. I guess it must have been more like a rave. They usually move around from place to place. They were here. Many of them. Cool.
Did you check out the club? Yeah. Cole here? Yeah, so what did you find? Nothing. Oh, come on, Mel. You can trust me. Oh, I get it, Mr. Undercover. Got to keep things quiet. Pretty hush hush. So, if he's involved in drug cases, it's got to be with the DEA or the FBI. Or maybe he's with the CIA or the ATF. He could be with any one of them, I suppose. Well, whoever is with has got a pretty unique cover. Whoever thought that Forrest Gump up there was a government agent. Well, I guess that's what having a cover's all about, right? I'm just gonna go upstairs and see how he's doing. Yeah, maybe you should take him a box of chocolates. <laughs> Very close to Fekman. On Sartop, it makes prisoners calm. For humans, a problem there could be. There could be a problem. Makes them very sick after a few times. Why? Your blood is different. Fekman blocks your hearts. Mandy had a heart attack. Who's selling this stuff? Only one can make it. And a Nixon. Caden interesting looking man he's a man isn't he he is male you find his image unpleasant somewhat nixons are not beautiful <laughs> glad there's a universal standard different than most species Nix is on far side of my car not much light their eyes more sensitive, as their hearing and smell is more sensitive. That's why they put it in their eyes. Goes in faster. How do we get the stuff off the street? Destroy where Caden makes it. First you have to find it. Fekman starts as powder. When it is made, some of Fekman will be to be going in the air. Goes in the air? Yes, it can be measured. We appreciate your help, Jess. Let me just grab my pads. Vic. Hi, Mel. Hi. Hey, didn't I see you? Cell phone. All right. I was just talking to Jess about her friend. Hey, I thought you were working homicide. Yeah, I am. I'm just helping out. The boys over in narcotics came up a little shorthanded, so... Uh, Jess is gonna come down to the station and give a description of the guy at the club. We're gonna need you to come along, too. Me? Why? Just a few questions. Oh, my God, I'm so sorry. I, Are you okay? Yeah, I, not bad. I, I didn't put enough money in the meter, and I saw trouble coming down the street. She's already nailed me five times this month. Okay. Getting nailed is bad? <laughs> All depends on who's doing the nailing, right? Do, do you have a quarter? I, I can't get another ticket. I really can't. Hi, you know, I've got some change here. It's just at the bottom of my purse, and if you want to hang on two seconds, I... I, uh, I don't know how to thank you. Um, how about if I buy you a drink sometime? You are hot for me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, you know, look, you know, I'm late for my therapist, but do you have a, a number? <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. 
Thanks. His face is fatter. So I hear you're living with some guy. That that guy was 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 that the guy? Because I've seen that guy before. His name is Cole, and he's not living with me. Yeah, that's the guy. Well, I didn't mean it in a cohabitating sense of the word, of, unless, of course, that's what you meant. That's not what I meant. And even if I did, what does this have to do with the investigation? Well, I was just trying to make conversation. Let's converse about something else. Okay. You dating anyone these days? His nose was a little bigger and longer. Kind of like Perry Farrell. But when he was still with Jane's addiction. Do you know what I mean? What up, dog? What you looking for? Crack? Smack? GHB? Roofies? X? Aha! <laughs> you a crystal man, right? Check this out. Got some real fine product right here. 40 a gram. <laughs> hey. Damn, baby, you cold. Cold. You're killing me here. I got expenses, you know? I right. Check this. I'll do you 30, but that's it. I am Cole. have jeopardized your place with me. What do you mean? The humans are no longer in the club. Well, there's one, a girl. She's at the police station. And she's giving them a detailed description of you. I'll have Vax take care of it. Make sure he does. Because if this continues, I'll consider it your error.
Put down the weapon. Because of that. I have made adjustments. Where is Caden? What's the problem? We're not doing anything. You sell Fekmar to humans. No. Caden told us to stop that. Where is Caden? At the club. Where is the club? It moved from place to place. It's somewhere on the west side. I'm not positive. In an old shoe factory on 17th Street! So you're gonna let me go now, right? No. That's him! Let's get a copy of this out on the street, all right? Thanks, Jess. It was great to see you again, Mom. Sure. Vic. I usually make a list. What? Vic, Cole, what to do? I make a list. You know, pluses, minuses. Add them up, subtract them out. I am not making a list. I'll make one for you. You've got Vic. Steady job. There's a lot to be said about steady job, you know. Jess. Cole. No job. Vic. Nice guy. Nice bot. Cole. Weird guy. But his bum? Mm -hmm. A work of art. Now, what they're like in the sack, that's the key. And you're going to have to give me some help here, because I'm not a mind reader. That's the other guy from the club. The one that gave Mandy that stuff. Oh, my God, run. Someone you met? You are upset. I am not upset. Where are you? Ocho Factory on 17th Street. The club is here. Uh huh. Well, we just ran into one of Caden's friends outside the police station. Came after us. Are you okay? We're fine. I have Jess making the lists longer to take her mind off of it. Lists. Never mind. What's your plan? To follow them home. Take their life forces. What about Caden? Hello? Cole. I'm losing you. What about stopping the drug? No bars, Mel. Many. That drug is going to find its way onto the street. That's what happens. 
They are not selling Fekman to humans now. It doesn't matter. There'll be a way. A forgotten pen, a, a few exceptions to the no human rule. Drugs are big business here. And this one kills people. Guaranteed, you've said so yourself. You're upset now. You have got to get this guy caught. I can't go there. Zinn has seen me. The rest of them haven't. Zinn knows they will not. Without Caden, there is no Fleckmark, Muffman, whatever the... Fleckma. Their hearing is sensitive. Pictures. I must see him now. I said he was busy. There... There could be a problem. A kind of problem with Fekman and a human. you at your post outside. Zin must see you. He is outside. In his car. Why doesn't he call? No bars. Someone from home. Even if you're born on the very best of terms. How does it feel to have so many former inmates so close to you? There are many of you, and one of me. Some of you will go before me. It is very painful. You will be 
next. You. Take him! Go. Tiffany? No, this is not a bad time to call. At least now you're out of intensive care, I can come and see you. Okay. I'll talk to you later. Mandy? Yeah. How is she? Better. But the doctors say it's going to be a few months before she gets back to normal. They still can't figure out exactly what she took. But it really messed up her heart. Oh, I'm sorry, we're not open for a couple of hours. Cole asked me to pick him up here. Cole? Yeah, that's right. We met yesterday. Tiffany. <laughs> Hey there. Hey there. I've got the top down on the Beamer. Beamer is a car. I know. I thought we'd see the new Lucas film. Lucas is a director. I know. I just love sci-fi, don't you? 